and in our top business story, the Dubai Diamond Conference 2015 has opened under the theme The New Silk Route, featuring interesting discussions between international leaders of the diamond industry who are gathered to explore opportunities for innovation and growth across Africa, the Middle East, and Asia. On this occasion, the ex executive chairman of the DMCC, Ahmed bin Sulaym, said that the Dubai diamond trade has grown from around $5 million since its inception 2002 to a value of $30 billion today, which shows that Dubai has transitioned into a significant international diamond trading hub over the past decade. He added that the two-day conference will provide an opportunity to discuss the growing importance of the trading routes between Africa, Dubai, and Asia, which will benefit Dubai's position among the top three diamond centers in the world. The Dubai Diamond Conference was attended by more than 500 delegates who, among other things, discussed $18 billion of non-oil trade between the UAE sub and Sub-Saharan Africa, the UAE's membership of the African Union, and the growing diamond trade. We have already the expertise. We've, uh, we've achieved a lot in such a short time. We have, we are, we've been here for over seven years now in the tallest diamond tower in the world, but that does not mean that's the end of the line as far as understanding the, what our members would like, what the industry would like, and get, bringing in a positive impact to the industry. And the conference is one of the ways of uh, getting those, uh, fleshing out the uh, best practices and new ideas. And uh, you have all the experts on the panel discussing uh, specific issues. They may not be big today, but, for example, synthetics might be an issue in the long run, and they would like to uh, mitigate uh, any perceived risk. And it all has to do with declaring what the goods are, should they welcome it, how to handle it, how does it affect. It's more of an understanding. It saves a lot of time. And in the conference, what a lot of these attendees as well value is networking and catching up. Dubai is in the business, which is going from west to east more and more, consumer demand growing in, in India, in China, Dubai is an ideal location. Apart from that, Dubai is also a consumption center. The Gulf consumes 9% of the global world consumption of diamonds. So with its 200 million people, we combine 9%, which is more than Europe, than the whole European Union with its 29, 28 countries. So it all looks quite, uh, quite good. There are, of course, always some challenges, weaknesses of the euro, the ruble, uh, oil price, which is low, that affects the, the market, let's say, on the short term, but the long-term perspective is excellent, cannot be better.